Hello, today we're going to give a brief overview on how to set up the SFK series of battery kits. This demonstration is will show how the basic kit is set up and how you can insert your batteries, mount your BMS, and have an enclosure that will keep your battery cell safe and also give the appearance of a standard looking uh, utility or recreational use battery. To begin, you will receive the kit with these aluminum brackets already mounted. They are riveted to the sides of the case and provide space for uh, the battery cells. You'll also be provided with two foam sheets which are inserted into uh, the sides of each of the battery wall and that will provide some insulation as well as a little bit of compression to the cells. So we'll do that next. Okay, we've inserted the foam inserts. As you can see, they have a little bit of a bow and that's by design. What that allows it to do is one, it will force the foam to uh, uh, lodge itself into inside the lip of the aluminum bracket, as well as it will add a little bit of uh, compression spacing so that um, when the cells are inserted, they have a uh, place uh, to, uh, you know, uh, so they can stay in place and they have a bit of compression in there, which will increase your battery life. So next we'll get started on installing cells. Um, beware, if you have purchased the basic kit, the cells are not included. So that's something that you'll need to provide yourself. Okay, now we'll begin mounting our cells. This is a fairly simple process. You'll begin by mounting the outer cells first. So in this case, we'll have one battery with a negative term terminal facing towards us. And then we'll have another battery with a positive terminal spacing uh, towards the other side. We'll then add another battery in the center. Now, you may notice that we added the outer batteries first and um, left a gap here. Now normally this would not be sufficient to allow a battery. That's where the foam, uh, oversized foam comes into play. What it's going to allow us to do is we'll have to kind of open up this gap and you can use it by putting your fist and then a horizontal orientation and it's going to allow you to slip that battery in on one side and while uh, you slide it in, you'll carefully position it. Once it's done, you should have a very snug fit keeping all the batteries in place. So we show you how that looks next. I'll have to do it with the camera off because currently I'm the only one filming and doing, but once completed, you'll get the idea.